As a population, we throw away 7 million tons of food and drink every year. And at a cost of $12.5 billion, it should come as no surprise that companies are working on ways to reduce this. Technology and science have teamed up in a variety of unique ways in order to alter the way we store and waste our food. One major issue they hope to tackle is the way foods such as bread, cheese, meats and snacks are wrapped in plastic packaging. Not only does this create a lot of non-recyclable waste, but thin plastic films are also questionable at preventing food spoilage. And it's these facts that led a group of scientists from the US Department of Agriculture to develop a biodegradable film substitute made of milk. The team have discovered that specific proteins from milk, called casein, could not only keep the food fresher for longer, but is in itself edible too. This means a potential resolution for both problems may well have been found. Using their findings, the team have created a unique film that is proven to be 500 times better than plastics at keeping oxygen away from food. And the material also has a number of versatile applications. In addition to being used as plastic pouches and wraps, the casein coating can also be sprayed onto foods such as cereal bars and flakes. A usage that not only eliminates food waste, but eliminates the need for additional sugars as well. Right now, cereals keep their crunch in milk due to a sugar coating. Instead of all that sugar, manufacturers could spray on casein protein coatings to prevent soggy cereal. The team are also developing a collection of single-serve pouches that would dissolve when heated up, releasing the substance inside and eliminating any waste. Project scientist Letitia Bonai recently demonstrated the groundbreaking product. Uh, I brought some hot water and one of our coffee, single-serve coffee pouches. So it is wrapped in our film and the film is heat sealed in a regular heat sealer, so it, it seals really well. It, it works really well at wrapping around food. It is uh, flexible, and then we just uh, press the sides with heat, and it melts. While the innovative product is not yet readily available, it promises one day to provide a biodegradable, sustainable, and edible alternative. And they're not the only ones searching for a solution to food waste. Narayanar Pesapathy and his wife have been developing an innovative technology that aims to eliminate another problem, plastic cutlery. Widely considered the only option when looking for something cheap and disposable to eat with, plastic cutlery has been around for years. But founder Narayanar has created an entirely natural alternative. His edible cutlery, called Bakey's, is made from 100% biodegradable and edible ingredients coming in a variety of sweet or savoury flavours. Here, there is no coating. In fact, it is entirely nutritious. You can eat up the spoon. Delicious. And the product, which relies on grain millets, also has a very impressive three-year shelf life. Not only this, but once used, it decomposes at an exceptional rate. You don't want to eat it, you can just throw it. It decomposes within four to five days. No longer is a spoon or fork just a spoon or fork. It could now be part of your actual meal. Plastic is very cheap, true. But I can make it as cheap. I can, with volumes. And once, when I get the volumes, I get onto the farmers directly and start procuring raw materials directly from the farmers, in which case, my spoons will be as cheap as the plastic spoons. And although the product is yet to hit the global market, the film appears to be capturing the world's attention with hundreds and thousands of views on YouTube. It's not just cutlery and packaging that is proving edible, though. 
Designers Chelsea Briganti and Lee Ann Tucker from the US combined their concern for the environment and passion for innovation to create Lollyware, the cup of the future. Their concept transforms once plastic cups into 100% edible substitutes that leave nothing behind. Available in flavours such as tart cherry, matcha green tea and vanilla, Lollyware hope that their product will one day become widely available one bite at a time. And finally, there's one team stepping forward to contribute an early new approach to food waste. Liquiglide are looking to eliminate the frustration of waste food left inside our bottles or containers. From the final traces of ketchup and mayonnaise that won't come out, no matter how hard you shake or squeeze, Liquiglide looks set to provide a solution. Developed in an MIT lab, a special edible coating is sprayed inside of bottles before the product. The coating creates a permanently wet, slippery surface in order to make the liquids inside slide or glide easier. Made from approved ingredients, the coating reportedly doesn't affect the taste or smell of the food. And according to the team, the invention would subsequently save 1 million tonnes of food waste each year. The team at Liquid Glide even took their innovative product to the streets of Boston in the United States to see how the public felt. What if I told you um, this packaging is coated with something on the inside that's made entirely from food, and that's what makes it slippery? Does that really? change your impression at all? No. No. It doesn't bother me now. A food? It's a food product. No. Well, it makes it uh, maybe even a little bit better if it's made of something I'm going to eat anyway. Whilst all of these are still in their early stages of production, each shows that one day science and technology may be able to reduce the way we waste food. How far away we are from those products hitting the mainstream, we'll have to wait and see.